Greetings family, we're still here at the Natural Museum in Arusha. So here we're going to show you this a nice presentation of this uh, the variation of animal species. And these are all animals that you'd see when you go to the different national park uh, in uh, Tanzania, whether you're going to the Arusha National Park, you're going to the Serengeti National Park or this. But in Gora Gora National Park design. or any of the other ones. I mean, that's, not, that's not good. Yeah. But some I, don't eat, I don't eat animals, that's not good. But from this place, mostly, we take after natural death, not after shooting. Oh, okay. You do yeah. what? Oh, natural, 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 natural death, not yeah. they were killed. Yeah. 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 So why is this one older than Thank this you. one? Because of the hair, you see the hair in the way? Okay. Looks like a darker. Yeah. Oh, he wasn't I killed, see. then yeah. he died naturally. Natural, yeah. Come on, what do you think about this the one? Is, everything is real, right? Yeah. No, do, you think, um, um, do, you, do you think this is a real size of a lion? Yeah, that's a real size no, of a lion. No, it's a real lion. It's, it's, um, it was, it's, that's a real size. What, what do you call it when you put the stuff in the animals? Stuff. Uh, they, they stuff it, they embalm it, yeah. they preserve it. You know? yeah, it's been embalmed. <laughs> Embalmed. They, they keep it. Take out the organs and then stuff it. Ah, yeah. yeah. Exactly. Yeah. It, and people may use different dolls. Yeah. Yeah. They may call it different dolls. Yeah. But it's, it, you know, it's, uh, you know, wow, this place is amazing. Embalm it like the mummy. So he died naturally. Yeah, naturally. Yeah. So that we have some kind of a female as well. Because in Tanzania, we are not allowed to keep female due to the laws. We are allowed to hunt only all the male. Mm -hmm. And there is a season for hunting in Tanzania, not all time of the year. We start hunting on the 1st of July until the end of December every year. Because from January to June it's common for rain season. So and I think you know most of the animals in the period of rain season, they start to breed in, they start breeding season for reproduction. So we get to kill the animal that time. It's and four species, I told you, we are not allowed to hunt for animals. These things are big and fast. Giraffe, <laughs> giraffe or national animal. Rhino, cheetah, and the wild dog. Mm -hmm. That's I don't know why white people think that they are superior when they come in and they, they, they start coming close to these animals. Like I've seen one video of the lion that's tore this white man apart. <laughs> All yours is bone scorching. <laughs> yeah, that's what I say. killing another animal. That's funny. <laughs> That's what I said, you're safe because we're in the vehicle. But then, this, I've never seen any um, lions at the, uh, the Arusha National Park. I'm sure there probably is, right? Yeah, no, no. They're not? No. Arusha National Park? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I've seen everything else but lions and elephants. Yeah, in the Arusha National Park, only the member of Big Five we have is buffalo only in Arusha National Park. So if y'all want to see more, y'all got to get to the Serengeti so family. We do those kind of journeys also. Yeah, I, don't, do. I may not go with you, but uh, you, you know, I will be not cheering you on. <laughs> it does, I think you know in the world rhino the endangered species. Yeah, rare species, the rhino. The lion. So that's that amazing, man. Mean, that's a big lion. The lion is bigger than you. So in Tanzania, if you visit, you have a chance to see the lion. Yeah, that's the lion. Yeah, yeah. That's the lion. Yeah. 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 Here is the jaws of the crocodile. Mm. Wow. The the, yeah, the, up, the upper part of the crocodile. I said it's upper part. Yeah. She's a little it's bit heavy. Okay. Mm. And you got a little. Wow. This is Pumba, the Rathok. Something's amazing. I know it's like your favorite part of the museum. <laughs> Seeing all these animals. See, yes, I mean, these are some of the animals and the, the bird species you're going to see. And one thing about our historical and cultural uh, journeys, you know, we emphasize a lot on you just experiencing just the country itself, nature, and all the history around that nature. I promise you, family, we're going to get to one of those national parks where we, you know, we see some some lions and we're just out there. You know? But also remember, we just started going to these national parks a few years back, because you know, in our West African tours, you know, we don't have a whole bunch of you know, presentation like this. You're mainly gonna find it in uh, Kenya, Tanzania, Rwanda, 
South Africa, Zimbabwe, you know, basically East and Southern Africa. But to me, one of the best things is just going out to the elements and then you see literally uh, seeing animals in nature and, you know, it's, it's all a part of this, you know, our experience of this learning. As you can see, there's many lions, and there's more lions than anything else in this presentation outside of birds. And then we have some more big animals back here. So our goal, family, is to get you just connected to nature, connected to just being open to an experience. And you know, when you're talking about lion, it's a, it's a serious business, family. You know, uh, these things are bigger than us, faster, stronger. Yeah, so the best thing I know how to do is just not put myself in that situation and you know, be out there in you know, any national park out there, you know, filming, like I'm you know, working for the National Geographic next, you know, something big and fast chasing you. So on our journeys, we make sure you're in an enclosed, you know, a vehicle and you're safe, you're good. And it's another thing I haven't seen is uh, elephants. So tomorrow we are going to the Arusha National Park. So unfortunately not all these animals you're going to see, but um, yeah. our good brothers from yeah. our legacy, our journeys is definitely going to connect you with that experience. And that's the students over there just uh, enjoying themselves at the nat Natural Museum. And then this is like a nice little arts and culture festival energy. Look like it's great for entertainment. And then in the back is some more shopping and then also the botan botanical uh, gardens. So yes, family, the journey of a lifetime continues. Come and experience the journey with us and open yourself to learning and let's keep the culture, the energy, the history and everything going because if we don't show up to these historical and cultural places yeah, it's not going to motivate the government and other people to keep it open so uh, you know the faith and the future of these things are in our hands so yes family you can connect with us on a journey of a lifetime by visiting our website at africaforTheAfricans.org the journey continues